We are at Media Day for the Chicago Sky with Center Ruth Riley, former Notre Dame star, for those of you who can remember all the way back. Does it seem that long ago? Was uh, it's, it's two, starting to what go. What was it, 2001? 2001, yeah. I mean, obviously, uh, watching our girls the last two years in the tournament and how far they were able to go brought back some memories, but I have to say, going on my 12th year, it's been a while since those days. So since then, you've been just doing nothing? Doing what? nothing. Oh, I'm sorry, playing basketball. That's that's almost doing nothing, right? Yeah, no, no. Uh, that's a lot of work. <laughs> it has. Uh, I mean, but I get to play sport for a living, so I can't complain. Uh, I mean, I do play pretty much three-fourths of the year, and then I take a little bit of time off to do some of the other things that I'm passionate about, but basketball has been, is where I spend most of my time. And playing with the sky, your anticipation is what this season? Well, I'm excited. I'm excited to be here. I think that we have a lot of new uh, players on our team this year, and it's going to be um, a great year for Chicago. I think you know, getting into the playoffs is our focus, and then you never know what happens from there. Is it fair to call you an elder stateswoman, or does that, that sound... No, I'm, not, I'm definitely up there. I'm uh, one of the best friend players in our league now, and so I've just been fortunate and blessed to play this long, and um, you know, myself, Tisha, and, and Swin, and Nicole, some of the older players. How, how do you last that long? Physically, mentally, I, I would think it's a fairly difficult existence, you know, even if you enjoy the game. Yeah, well, I think it's uh, taking care of your body first and foremost. I mean, training smarter uh, as you get older and, um, you know, continuing to work on your game. I think, I, um, you know, I've been fortunate to have great coaches who have helped me along the way. If you're not working on your game, you're not going to last as long. Now, do you set personal goals, even if you say you're not setting personal goals, as f far as what you'd like to accomplish? You know, I, my role changes a lot, and I think here's going to change on the lineup. Uh, you know, if I'm playing with Sil or if I'm coming in for Sil, I think, you know, like my role on the team is, is going to be a little different, but, um, you know, the first week in training camp has gone well, and so I think once we start playing games, I'll be able to evaluate what are realistic goals for myself. And do you have any idea how you see your role on the sky? I kind of uh, on court? A little bit of everything. Uh, I think uh, you know, playing complimenting still, playing high low, uh, being able to knock down some shots from the outside, a great passer, screener, defender. Um, probably those are probably the main goals there. All right. Well, we'll look forward to a, a long and prosperous season then. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Thank